Okay, folks, I found this in the gutter. I think it was in the gutter, yeah. And I'm going to make this into something nice, even though it's a bit filthy, a little bit dirty. Um, it's an interesting piece. We've done quite a few of similar types of things before. This one's definitely going to be a 400 job. Okay, let's see what this is. It is a beer can, some kind of um, overseas beer. It's got, looks like you think it's made in Holland by the name Hollander. We're interested in the, this side and we're going to try and take this little section out of it. So we're just going to put it on the glass. A bit fucking filthy, you'd say, something like this. Um, Hollander, Holland, Hollandia. I'm just going to put it like so. Yeah, that's come up in quite interesting, uh, I do think. I actually think we might do something different, a um, bit more creative than... Oh, we were going to enlarge that, uh, but I think we're going to try something different, folks. Gonna turn it on an angle. Gonna make it more interesting, folks. I don't know how this is gonna look. I think it's beer, some kind of beer from overseas, imported. Uh, that's come up looking quite interesting, actually. Uh, so we're just going to move this away, just throw that in the recycle. I don't know, it looks a bit minimalist. Uh, I don't know how it's going to look. Um, trying to work out whether to go run with it or not. Looks a bit on the minimalist side, folks. I'm not a real fan of minimalism anyway, as a general rule, but I do produce a lot of pieces that would be classified perhaps as minimalist or what I refer to as semi minimalist where it looks a little bit minimalist but it's not as minimalist as as a normal really really extremely minimalist piece would be that it's somewhere between having the busyness of something fairly average normal or better than normal art shouldn't be just about normalcy because a lot of people artists are often very eccentric and, and to be creative you've got to be something outside of the normal because everything's normal and everything's about being normal, but then what we use in our art is often normal things, like things with labels, like Coca-Cola or or, um, or or a magazine, like a like a, a Who magazine. And it's called pop cut pop art, you know. So 
I guess you take you're taking. Oh, so it's hard to explain art, folks, because art is in, is there's so many different types of art and so many different genres and schools of thought and ideas, opinions, and that's why I guess people go to art school to learn all that shit, to learn art speak, all this weird language that art people often talk in, which is a load of shit in my opinion, but, you know, it's what they do um, a lot of the time. I'm not one of those types of elite kind of artists, I'm one of the lowliest kinds. But anyway, that's come up looking really quite nice. I think we can now call this demo quits.